Hey guys, for this month of March, we're giving away another HyperX Cloud 2 headset. This is actually the headset I use, and I love it. All you have to do to win is play on any of my servers, and you'll earn a raffle ticket every hour. Now onto the raid. If you guys didn't know, the latest forced wipe update that came out introduced CCTV cameras so you can actually throw them up on your base and watch them from a laptop inside the base safely. This dude that I'm about to raid, he had some CC cameras up. I heard some movement in the base. I'm not sure if he spotted me through the camera feed. But anyways, I wanted to go ahead and give it a try raiding this guy online, even though he does have cameras. He had a missing high wall here. Not sure what happened. Somebody's also laddered up into the compound, it looks like. But I was basically just crouching up here and there's a building structure going on over there too. That's a huge tower. Right by the lighthouse, that one's all armored as well. We'll have to watch our back from that, from getting counter rated. But I wanted to basically go straight into this thing. And I'm on the camera right now. So it is stone here. This should be one of the best ways to go in. He's got an armored roof here too. See if we can hear any movement in here. Okay, maybe we can bypass this. We'll send four rockets. We've got armored walls. It's gonna get expensive. We'll send 8C4 here. Hearing some movement in there. We might be going to the roof. Oof, that was close. We've got a sleeper. Our workbench is gonna be in the way. There's no way, dude. No, I got rocketed. He was definitely ready for that. He sent a rocket. I'm not sure if he saw me on the CC camera or not in the beginning. It's a possibility though. We're totally in here. He's right above me though. Let's go! Does he have my stuff on him? Need that launcher. Nice try, buddy. 20 rockets in here, guys! Almost a thousand explosive ammo. 30 C4, 12 rockets, that's what I had on me though, pretty sure. That was actually really close. We need to load this rocket launcher up and take this TC out. Let's go. So let's take this TC. Make sure this guy does not spawn in anymore. No way, dude. Whew. That was close. I'm honestly, might just take his sulfur if he's got any in here. 34k sulfur. All right, I'm gonna leave with this stuff before he comes back. Can maybe wall throw TC out here? Let's go, I can't believe that actually worked. I don't know why he wasn't prepared to rocket me again. But let me put this stuff away, we'll come right back. We'll take back like a few C4. Maybe a few rockets, too. Since he's gonna want a rocket PvP me, I might as well bring some rockets. Alright, second trip back here for loot. I wonder if he's expecting me. This should be secure. He probably has weapons in there, though. He's 
It's not waiting for me or anything. I believe we still had some mats in here. Yeah. And I think you put this wall up possibly? No. Let's see what we can do with this garage door. So this goes around. That's his computer station. We should be able to see the cameras from here. You got some more lock boxes in here. Let's check this out. Oh my god, <laughs> gonna have to blur that out. He made these cameras like bad names, but let's see what we got here. Alright, he's got the water. And the rest of these are pretty much trash. So yeah, this is what it's gonna look like. Pretty cool. Not the best camera placement there. We'll take out the rest of these boxes and see what else he had. Nothing in there, and some metal ore. I'm not positive if it was profit, it's gotta be. I mean, I'm not sure how much of that stuff he got from me, but we did see the 34-ish K silver, so it should turn out to be some pretty decent profit. Kind of a smaller base raid, but it was online, and I kinda wanted to see what those cameras were all about. Take these bean cans out, and I'll call that a success. Not bad. Okay, so we're going from a base with cameras and surveillance up to a base that I didn't see any CC cameras mounted on the outside. He does have a high wall compound and there's a cave like right next here. I'm really hoping he's not storing his main stuff in that cave, but we're gonna give this medium sized base a shot up here on the hill. So there's a sheet metal door on the front. I'm thinking that we could take that pathway. Let's get in the actual compound first. Oof, nearly died there, but we're good. Sheet metal door going to another sheet door. I have some rockets on me, not many, but we could go ahead and try this sheet door. The base is also only one and a half stories high though. I'm thinking we could actually drill down, maybe in the center here somewhere. There's some extra honeycomb on this side. Let's go ahead and drill in the center. Probably gonna be armored here, we'll see. Yeah, armored half floors, kind of expected. It's gonna become really expensive though. Check stability here. This looks like it's all honeycombed, 87%. At least with doorways, maybe with walls. Over here we've got 73%. Could it be open down here? Maybe we'll try this. Okay, so trying our luck here on this triangle. There's a coffin? Shotgun trap and a sleeper, is that an M2? No. Two coffins, 10 sulfur. 27 C4 in this box. Plus 27 rockets. All right, I guess we scored big time there. This wall's soft, I think we should take this door. And there's TC, dude, it's too easy, man. Stability gave it away. See if they have any sulfur in here. 16,408 sulfur. A little bit of HQM left. Man, it's just too easy. So I kind of want to get out of here before the counter raiders come. I mean, we saw components. Saw C4, rockets, and sulfur. That was just a really simple raid. I'm not even going to bother putting a new TC. Let's just get right on out of here. All right. Well, that was a pretty successful start to the wipe. I'll be seeing you guys soon, and I'm gonna throw the wipe schedule up on the screen right now. Make sure to check out my 5X servers with BPs if you guys want more of a challenge. And I'll be seeing you guys tomorrow.